What's going on guys? Back at it again with potentially the last video for Fallout 76 before Wastelanders. I know I said that once before, but the last time I said it, this was right literally the day before uh, it was announced that Wastelanders was getting postponed or delayed because of the coronavirus. So now this hopefully cross my fingers unless they make another announcement this should be in theory the last fallout 76 video uh prior wastelanders which makes me very happy and excited because uh, by the time you guys watch this tomorrow will be the wastelanders dlc drop but with that being said we're going to potentially do the last few missions that i'm planning to make here for you guys on the channel starting with that whole miscellaneous quest on the top right corner says reach the mayor's office and that's over there in Watoga. If you're excited to watch this video or if you're enjoying the series in general whatsoever, do me a huge favor and drop a like on this video because it helps YouTube's algorithm and in turn helps my channel grow. And while you're at it, if you're not already subscribed, also subscribe to the channel because that definitely helps the channel grow as well. So with that being said, let's just go ahead and jump right into this. All right, so first things first, I got to eat. <laughs> All right, I'll drink a couple of boiled waters while we're here. And I think I have some Myalurk meat. Yes, we do. And now we should be good to go to fast travel all the way to freaking Watoga. It's really far. So let's go ahead to the Watoga Municipal. It's 54 caps, but luckily we have over 1,200 caps. Now a little less than that, but it's all good. This mission is... A lot of people's favorite uh, missions or whatever, obviously I think the common consensus on what the best mission is, is probably the whole Mistress of Mystery questline. That mission is just fantastic, and it's probably up there on one of my favorites as well, but my favorite is actually Belly of the Beast, uh, which is a Brotherhood of Steel questline, which in turn also, probably the Brotherhood of Steel is probably my favorite faction in this game in particular. Um, just the way they flesh them out a little bit but a lot of people do like this you know mission as well but we got to be careful though because a lot of robots are going to be hostile to us right now protect and serve there we go i'll take that lead though staff would be happy to assist you today Citizens, sure why not let's go i don't care about you lady right now i'm just trying to get to your mayor so that i can do this quest and have friendly robots here Thank you. All right, there's a lot of bad things here, so. Oh man, I was hoping I can like phase through the wall. Hiya! We literally have to get to the very top of the building. So I gotta figure out how to get up there. Is it over here? Well, the answer is no, but might as well kill this dude while we're at it. Here again. I swear they need they need new lines. <laughs> they say the same th stuff over and over again. Where's the damn stairs? I need to go up. Oh, found them. All right. It's kind of funny though, cause like, whenever I've done this before, I I literally just run straight through. You don't have to fight anybody if you know which way to go. Which I'm already here, pretty much. You die. Oh, you're the big boss man, huh? You think you're special? You think you're hot shit, bro? Well, let me give you a quick news flash. You're not. That's why you're dead. Yeah. Get on that. So now we're here. Let's go talk to the lovely mayor. Congratulations, citizen. By mayoral executive order, all individuals entering this room shall have the office of mayor bestowed upon them. I am your mayoral artificially intelligent assistant. You may call me Maya. I'll be your guide through the transition period and your faithful assistant once you get settled. Allow me to play the outgoing mayor's final message. Maya, are you still following the executive order about people who walk in here? Yes. Pull up the pertinent entries on our situation and the saboteur on the mayoral terminal for anyone who walks in here to read. Certainly. Ma'am, sensors indicate you are losing large quantities of blood. Shall I summon a paramedic to assist you? No! What's wrong with you? 
No more robots. Maya. <coughs> Make sure the next mayor hears this. Of course. I have failed. Whoever you are, you are mayor of a dead city. Those I couldn't evacuate have perished. There's no one, nothing left. But maybe you're here to rebuild from the ashes. <sighs> That's a comforting thought. I managed to squirrel away a cache of resources. But before you can live here, you need to figure out how to deal with the robots. It was sabotage. The terminal entries should explain what... Oh. 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 Ma'am, are you all right? I think this is it. My sincerest apologies. I can't be of more assistance. It's all right. <laughs> I, I hope you don't get too lonely here all by yourself. <laughs> Goodbye, Maya. Goodbye, ma'am. It was a pleasure to serve you. You were an excellent mayor. Well, I certainly tried. <sighs> End of recorded message. Oh, snap. So she said to look at the terminal about a saboteur. Sounds like they hacked, found a way to hack those robots and now they're attacking people. Read this. High priority. Will do. You must have the confidential clearance to access this terminal. Mayor for a day. Alrighty. So it's a complete chaos out there. It's complete chaos out there. People got too used to the robots and computers doing everything for them. People are literally running around on fire out there. Literally? Man. Uh, I'm doing my best, but really, I'm just a music teacher. I'm not cut out for all this. Once everyone is safely out of town, I'm going to try to broker a truce with the saboteur. Rumor is his hideout is somewhere in Bogtown. Might just... Uh, be prejud uh, prejudicate. I don't know what that says. Hearsay. Uh, <laughs> but it's just a place to start anyway. Things are getting bad. Every time I leave this office, I'm less certain I'll make it back. But someone has to try to hold things together. While well, we get everyone out, and for whatever reason, fate put me in charge. As a precaution, in case I don't make it back, I've issued an executive order to update the automated uh, mayoral selection process to simply accept everyone who enters uh, the room as mayor for a day. I figure that would make it easiest for whatever might arrive to help. In the long run, that might be prob problematic, but we need all the help we can get if we if we're even going to see a long run as mayor you should have access to all the files in this machine if you if i don't make it uh maybe you can find the saboteur's hideout and put a stop to all of this people are going to need a safe place in the coming months when things irre ev whatever fall apart Watoga was the perfect place, except for the berserk robots. But if we can deal with that, good luck to all, to us all. Barbara Elizabeth, 134th uh, fourth mayor of Watoga. Supply cache. In case I don't make it, I have instructed Mia to withhold access until the robots have been dealt with. I don't want to waste precious supplies on mere looters. So... If you want those supplies, you're going to need to help us. Oh, snap. Uh, selection committee letter archived. To whom it may happily concern. Welcome to the, uh, your new position as mayor of Otoga. It's time to get to work. You never know how long uh, you have until the selection process picks a new mayor. It could be a year from now. It could be tomorrow. Some may find these random term limits frustrating, 
most will find them liberating because folks don't know how long you will be in office. You won't be uh, hounded by special interest and corruptions, uh, corrupt enterprises trying to curry your favor with bribes. You can safely assume people are being honest and truthful with you. How lovely. If you want to issue an executive order, declare a state of emergency, or simply talk to someone who understands the heavy burden of governing, speak to Mia or my, M Maya. I don't know. Your mayoral artificial intelligence assistance. Tell her what you want. She will draft the appropriate legislation. She's been programmed full of important and incidental information uh, pertinent to the governing of a city. Maya's knowledge base comprises of decades worth of carefully curated uh, news articles, court opinions, and legislators, uh, legislature of all 50 states, and even some older data dating back to the Middle Ages. If you have a question or are even confused about a possible uh, course of action, just ask Maya. She'll give you one or three good answers to choose from. But always remember, you are the mayor, and all the mayoring is up is your responsibility and yours alone. And remember, because no one in the government is elected and everyone is appointed with term limits uh, decided by the mayor, each mayor is free to hire and fire at his or her own discretion. Furthermore, the Watoga Constitution clearly grants the mayor's executive orders the force of law, with the single exception that no such law be made that uh, curtails that authority. How's that for f for a feeling of responsibility? What's next? Relax. The day to day operations of the city are entirely automated, from the sanction authority to the chief of security. All the small and big functions of running the city clearly or cleanly, efficiently, and effectively are all handled. By carefully programmed robots. This lets you and your administration focus on the things that matter to the citizens. And as a valued and respected Watogian yourself, you know exactly what those things are. By doing away with the elections, instead of randomly selecting citizens in good standings to serve as mayor, we have made Watoga the most democratic democratic city in the entire world everyone has a chance to run things not just the politicians now it's your turn you are the mayor now and yes you can do this the inaugural watoga mayor selection design committee oh crap list of pertinent executive orders here's a list of here's a list of less uh recent but important or historic executive orders. I will keep this list up to date as best I can. Some of the best records I have access uh, to have been corrupted. Database maintenance uh, have been alerted to the problem, but have not yet found a solution. My sincerest apologies. I could, couldn't be more helpful. Maya. All right, so Transportation Authority Preferential Treatment Act error. File corrupted, okay. No, oh, they're all errored. All right, Mayoral Freedom of Responsibility Act. No executive order, nor any law, ordinance, rule, or other mayoral proclamation with the force of law shall be created or enforced in such wise that it would render any previous uh, render any previous order law ordinance rule or proclamation irrevocable unassailable unchangeable or in any way unlimited then this is all legal talk all right where are we at these are all laws i'm not really interested in any of this all right let's go
So now we gotta find the saboteur. He said in Bogtown, right? Bogtown is all the way up there. Damn, we haven't discovered it yet. So let's go ahead and fast travel to this. I think it's Pylon V9 or something like that. And then we'll just run up uh, over there. I think there's a work bench there too. Like one of those uh, claimable workshops or whatever. Should be uh, should be there. If I remember correctly, I'm pretty sure that's Bogtown. I don't like claiming that place because it always gets attacked by like high level enemies. And that can honestly get pretty annoying. But who knows, this guy's pretty tanky. If I had a pretty strong weapon, might have a... Yeah, see, there's a workbench here. Might have a pretty easy job if I had a stronger weapon. Let's go! Oh, look, it's a Wendigo. Hi, Wendigo. Hi, Feral Ghoul. Hi, other Feral Ghoul. Hi. You're so cute. Alright, time to put you down now, buddy. Here you go. Last one. I promise. Goodbye. <laughs> I literally destroyed him. Alright, well now that this is done, let's go ahead and take a rat away. I probably shouldn't have let him hit me because... Um... It damages my armor. Saboteur's hideout. Pretty confident isn't here. What the hell is that? Another Wendigo? Do I gotta put you down too? Get out of here. Alright, you know what? I'm done with you guys. I'm done. Goodbye. Alright, let's go ahead and go around. I'm very confident it's in here. Yep, found it. Alright, so let's listen to this. Last words. Alrighty then. So, letter from Jenica. Scott, what the hell? Are you serious? Thought you were just talking shit. How could you do that? All those people. The world is literally ending and uh, all we need... We all need to stick together. If we're going to make it, everyone is... We gotta stick together if, if we're going to make it. Everyone's hair is falling out. Their eyes are bleeding or worse. And the only hospital for miles is in Watoga. What have you done? I hope you die. You're a monster, Jenica. Let's listen. Let's look at the next one. Jenica, if you somehow get this, know how sorry I am, how deeply sorry. I am a monster. It's true. I did it because I believed in a world where all men and women were uh, would be equal. I was trying to make that world come true. At least in Watoga, but if there's no people left alive, that's not the equality I meant. How was I supposed to know the bombs were dropping the very next day? But that's no excuse. Even if the world had, uh, hadn't had ended, what I did was wrong. I know. Damn. Alright, let's listen to this. It's done. I broke the transmission sequencer so no one will be able to remotely reconfigure the machine. 
I also corrupted the software on the update terminals throughout the facility. The only machine capable of creating updates is now in my office. I've locked my terminal and wrote a little fix to the building's badge access software to prevent any badge other than my own from accessing it. <laughs> they won't be able to get help from anyone else. Only I will hold the means to their salvation. Soon, they'll come down from their ivory towers and come begging me to make it stop. And when they do, I'll make each and every one of them fill out my resident application fitness report. And then, I'll deny every last one of them. <laughs> we'll see how they like it. Being judged. Being locked out in the cold. Alright. Well, that's stupid. Can I take one, or does this take it all? Alright, cool. Got one. Free Watoga. I have to go all the way to the top now. Uh, A, B, C, D, E, F. Free Watoga. Alright. Oh, this is just like a... A list of what they were doing. We asked for fair... Wi okay. Letter to the mayor. Mayor Thomas H. Molly. I'm serious. This was for real. You remember that day all the chief bots in the city were destroying all the food? That was me. The last mayor was about to issue an executive order to vacate the city. Why won't you believe me? Surely she wrote something down. A draft of the law. Perhaps a journal or something. Uh, this whole ransom... Mayor's thing is really stupid. Did no one run any experiments or simulations on how terrible that idea was? I'll be at the place on Monday. Just be there. Sincerely, Scott W. Turner. Alright. Let's, uh... Letter to Mom. Mom, I know you don't believe it. Uh, will ever happen, but it will. I'm getting closer. I was able to get all the chief bots to pepper bomb all the food in the entire city. When I can crack down, uh, crack down the emergency services protocols, then the revolution will begin. When it's done, I want you to move to Watoga. If Dad doesn't want to come, fine. Let him rot in that hellhole, but you deserve better. Scooter. Letter to Sandy. Sandy, you're back in. Meet me round back of the facility after hours again i'll sneak you in and record your likeness back into the program next time don't be such a jerk scott all right uh herald editorial on allegory asylum i feel like we've read this before this is literally on the brotherhood of steel base i'm sure there's a key for this man but Actually, you know what? I can hack this. I literally always just play the guessing game. I'm sure there's a better way to do this. But I don't care to learn. I hate these little mini games. I just want to get this over with. O M G. Nope. I always leave one just in, just so that it doesn't lock me out. There we go. All right. I do not grant anyone the right to look through this contents of this device. You must have a warrant to access this machine encrypted message. Turner, where the hell are you? I know the world's gone crazy, but we need you here. Please, if you get this, come in. This is the safest place around for miles. Certainly safer than that rusting tin can you call at home. Something's gone terribly wrong at Watoga. All the robots have gone offline or if those insane uh, reports are to, believed, to be believed, they all went berserk and are killing everyone. It's not just our bots. It's all of them. So it must be something with the universal control protocol protocols but we can't seem to revert to earlier updates uh a private citizen's machine is that this machine i don't know you're our best programmer hell 
you wrote most of the control protocol protocols yourself. We need you. I tried to get into your office hoping I'd find something helpful on your terminal, but none of that of the department badges work. It says there's been some kind of screw up and only your badge will get us in. Why can't they just override that? I don't know. Robco, it, the best and brightest in the industry, right? Look, just get in there if you can. If not, be safe. K Hayward. Oh, shit. So he really did do all this. All right, it's okay. A little wordy, but it gets the job done. I still think People's Party is a little too commy for my taste, but we voted. And, in, and I'm still a believer in democracy, so you still uh, going to print these at work, or do I need to acquire print ribbons from somewhere? Oh, this is the same thing that we saw, Free Watoga. Uh, Equipped in message, January 15th. Uh, sorry, man. I know you really wanted to bring Keith into the fold, but he can't be trusted. Not yet. He's, he might agree with our principles, but he doesn't have the stomach for what needs to happen. Not yet, anyway. Once the party takes off, once we have something to show, then maybe. But until then, he's more of the liability than an asset. Hee <laughs> hee. Maybe you are starting to rethink that whole this is a democracy thing all right okay thought about what you said last night i'm in but we need a better name no one's going to care if they think it's just the three of us we need a name that's gonna sound like a real movement how does the free watoga people's party sound that sounds so commie man it's insane all right Free as in freedom. Who doesn't want more than that? And people, because it's time we, the people, actually take a stand against all these damn robots taking uh, over everything and party. Uh, like we were a legit force. And we know how to organize. And also, like we know how to party. Like last night. I had no idea you could dance like that. Remind me to get you drunk more often. <laughs> oh my god. Alright, disengage lock. Let's go ahead and get into this place. Saboteur's password. Sure. Okay, saboteur's work password. That's the same freaking thing. Alright, so... Saboteur's work person... Uh, that's over there robco luckily it's not too far from here so let's go ahead and make our way over there hopefully that radio that was in there playing music the entire time doesn't get me demonetized but i'm very confident it will so if you guys could do me a huge favor and at least like the video like drop a like on the video i would really really appreciate it because chances are i'm not gonna make a dime ever for for this video so if you guys could do that for me i would greatly 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 appreciate it man this is like the time that i wish i had uh swing speed on this Oof. thank you a little ibot for helping me out that was very awesome of you i was just there not that long ago actually You can't beat these deals. Bet you I can. Alright, we're actually approaching uh, Robco now. This is a pretty elaborate plan that severely, severely backfired on him. Doesn't sound like he wanted to... Like, it was intentional. He really did want to sabotage Watoga. That's why they call him the saboteur. But, in all reality, I don't think he ever wanted to kill everyone. The robots just kind of malfunctioned, so... Might have been unintentional, but it's still his fault, you know what I mean? Ooh, caps. 
All right, let's go ahead and go in there and find his work terminal. Chances are it's a hell of a lot more reading. Which I'm sure you guys probably think it's painstaking uh, staking because I'm not a very good reader. And you know what? It's okay. So since Wastelanders, hopefully, cross my fingers, comes out tomorrow finally. Um, what are you guys planning to side with? The Raiders or the actual people? I know personally for this character, I'm planning to side with the Raiders only because it'll be different and I kind of want to see both sides of the story. Um, but for my main character, I'm going to side, side with the good guys. So probably at the end of this video, I'll probably go back to my camp and probably don some, I was going to say creation club, but some uh, Adam shop stuff. To make me look more like a raider. Alright, let's, let's see what this is. Scan likeness. Okay, so... We're good here. Facility... Oh, take the virus to Mia's holotape. I'm going to show you an easy way to cheese this, by the way, at the very end. It's going to be hilarious. Alright. Uh, it has come... Uh, to the board of directors attention that you might know personally one or more of the protesters which have been harassing military convoy deliveries damn their their plan even goes that far if this is true the board would be very interested in appre uh, appreciative of your sharing any information you might have regarding these increasingly embarrassing incidents Lisa M. Fields, Director of Insight and Morale at Robocco Facility. Okay. Personal message, 912. I'm about to send you an official message. Don't reply with anything stupid, all right? I think... I'll think it through. Oh, dude, it was all calculated. Turner, what are you doing with that camera? I heard a rumor uh, you are writing a program to scan faces uh, with that thing. Are you... an this another side project or Rob goes uh, sanctioned and why you why do you get to do this side project anyway key congratulations I took your proposal to the directors it was a nearly unanimous approval the loan holdout wouldn't surprise you I promise them this was strictly after hours uh, side project and would in no way impact your regular critical duties. I did, however, uh, leave out the fact you are planning to do work on this from home. I trust you have appropriately secured your terminal and are only allowing encrypted communications between your home and work terminals. That's why the, it was encrypted. I had a friend in legal discreetly look into your employment contract. Looks like you were hired back in the cowboy days. You're effectively grandfathered in, but let's not go advertising what we're, what you're doing. We can't afford to raise any red flags and have HR want to renegotiate all our contracts. Good luck, and don't forget who your friends are when, uh, when you are running this place. After your uh, inventive invention makes a million dollars, Lisa Fields, director of Inside Morale. Okay. Last one. A friendly reminder that staff are so conspicuously wear their badges at all times. This means you. It doesn't matter what department you work in, how long you have been here. If you are part of full, a part or full time, if you, if your name is on the door or if you have a reserved parking space. Everyone must comply with this rule. See your staff policies and guidelines. Page three for details. As always, don't hesitate to call if you have any questions. Thank you, Tamara Michaels. All right, so let's go ahead and fast travel back to Watoga and give this essentially to Mia, the virus holotape to Mia, because I'm pretty sure we can disable the robots or at least make them friendly again after this so that's a really good thing because now Watoga could potentially have a future and effectively really have a reasonable 
you know, reason to be called the city of tomorrow. The pumpkin house. <laughs> That's crazy, dude. The saboteur, this dude, he was too smart for his own good. But, oh well. It eventually ended up led him to die anyways. Which kind of makes me wonder, how did he die? Doesn't It, it never said, did it? He just kind of died right there at his own house. Unless I missed something. But... For all I know, he did get a very sour letter from, I believe, a girl called Tamara. Which was extremely mad at him. under uh, For good reason, Protect. of course. But it kind of sounds like he might have just committed suicide. But who knows. Alright, I'm going to actually just run straight there. If the bad guys respawn. No. Open the door. Looks like they did respawn. All right, so it was up here. No, it wasn't this way. It is not this way. Get out of my way. Oh, wait. It was this way. Well, turn too much. And then uh, this way. No, not this way. Get out of there. Oh, this way. See. Shut up, you crazy scorched man, you. Run! Well, there's nobody up here, but still. Run! Mia, I got something for you. And good news. Ah, what have we here? Sir, this is a citywide software update for all municipal robots. He followed me. This needs to be uploaded and broadcast from the uplink tower on the roof. Once you arrive there, I'll guide you through the process over the intercom system. Okay. I would call a maintenance crew to do this for you, but as I understand it, they would just murder you. <laughs> and I, to my never-ending chagrin, was constructed lacking hands, so I'm afraid you'll need to do it yourself. You can conveniently reach the roof from this office. My sincerest apologies, I can't be of more assistance. No, you did enough. I, I think there should be an elevator. Yep, right here. And then we just go, I'm about to show you a way to cheese this, man. It's super easy to do without even having to do anything because... Once you upload the virus holotape or whatever, there's like a never-ending wave of enemies that come. So I want to cheese it. I like cheesing it only because I like to save my armor as much as possible. So I'm about to show you how I like to cheese it. It's pretty funny. And it works even better if you have, if you're a stealth character, they'll never find you. And you just basically chill out until it's done. There's only one thing that could find you, Uplink and that's a freaking from where scorch you are beast. Now. You'll need to upload the software update into the terminal at its base. Then, wait for the broadcast and citywide reboot. Okay, sounds easy enough. Alright, upload update software. Sir, there appears to be a glitch in the update software, which has misinterpreted the monitoring software as a virus. This has triggered a full building lockdown, and a security force has been dispatched to your area. Again, my sincerest apologies. I can't be of more assistance. So, I could literally just stay here. Most of them, I mean, occasionally they'll freaking hit me from down there. But you know what? I'll stay here for maybe like a minute or something like that. And then the rest of the time, I'll actually go over there and fight. Just for the sake of this video not being me camping the whole time. You saw Mr. Guts here right there. Oh, here comes the uh, Scorch Beast. That'll be funny as hell if I just fall off, wouldn't it? Alright. Once it gets to... Once it breaks the three minute mark, we're gonna go. 
Dude, this is crazy. Look at all these freaking bird bots. Yeah, this is a very easy way to cheese this mission. You, you can, I swear, you can literally just stay here the whole time. And like I said before, if you have... Oh, every once in a while they'll find you. But it's very easy to just lose them again. Just like that, and then come back over here. And you're pretty much good to go again. But if you have stealth, it's even easier, dude. Because you can literally 100% cheese this without ever being seen. But it looks like it's about to be game time. So, three, two, one, let's go. Oh man, I thought I could jump over it. <laughs> What's up? What's up, Mr. Gutsy? Oh man, I'm about to say, are you gonna die? Come on, we can live for three minutes, dude. Uh, this mission sucks because they literally don't stop coming. Although sometimes it like kind of bugs out and they stop spawning. Did another one show up? Who's that one shooting? Oh, what the hell? This guy just appeared out of nowhere. Die! Is that everybody? Oh god. Oh god. The thing that sucks about being a melee character is that you generally suck against Scorch Beasts. So we got two more minutes. So for the Scorch Beasts, I mean, they're not, they're not showing up, so we're good. We are gravy. I wonder where this leads. I've actually never been in here. But it looks like more robots can spawn over here. Um, I mean, I'm not a commie, but sure, why not? Oh man, they all spawned again. <laughs> Me? Tired? Come on, bro. Really? We got one more minute left. Are you ready to die for your country? Die! Who's the Scorch Beast fighting? Die! No, get over here, I bought Damn. I mean, I don't know why you would be carrying caps, but alright. Looks like 37 more seconds and we're golden. There's a... A uh, uh, cool little chill spot up here if you want to just chill. But then you'll be free game towards the Scorch Beast. <clears throat> Ow. Wait a minute. Alright, let's see. So up, upload update software. Did I do it? Oh no! See, that's why I like to cheese it. My armor's broken. Oh god. I'm taking more damage now. Alright, let's go ahead and eliminate the rest of these guys. Wait a minute, did it just restart? Like, for real? I think I have, which is broken. All my armor is pretty much broken. All right, let's go ahead and inspect and repair. And I think I have to improve. Yep. All right, cool. At least now I have all my armor up to par. But I guess we got to wait a little longer. Oh, God, here they come. We're going to get the drop on them. All right, cool. One down. Oh, God. All right. You know what? Fuck that. 
It's getting cheesed. Yeah, one more. For good measure. Come on, baby. Man, they're freaking... This is insane, dude. We're, everyone's going at it right now. I don't know why, but I... Uh, especially after playing Fallout 4, man. Those freaking Vertibots make me really believe that that's the Brotherhood of Steel. Even though I know it's not the Brotherhood of Steel. Any day now. Come on, baby. I wonder if that happened because I ended up leaving the area. Who the hell is shooting at me? Oh, there's a set of power armor down there. Two more minutes. Two and a half more minutes, technically. I don't care. They can keep hitting me. It's better than getting hit by those freaking Mr. Gutsies, man, because those things hit hard. Like, they chopped me up into little pieces on my main character because he doesn't have high endurance. It's pretty funny. But, I mean, we're, we're, we're golden so far. Come on, baby. Luckily, those freaking, that Scorched Beast isn't attacking me. I know a lot of people carry a shotgun with, uh, with that one, uh, shotgun perk. I, I can't remember what it is. Uh, enforcer to like cripple limbs and stuff like that because it has a higher percentage rate I guess to, to hit like limbs and stuff and that's how they down them oh god is he targeting me now he's not he is alright one more minute we can do this one more minute Ah, uh, baby. We're in the seconds. Did he just land? I think he just landed. Get away from me, Mr. Gutsy. Oh, he's down there. Well, he just passed us like, like nothing. Come on, 30 more seconds, baby. We got this. Twenty-five. Oh god. It's so close I could taste it. Alright. Ten. Nine. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four, three, two, one. Yay! I completed the quest. You have been cleared for the highest security level. The municipal robot should no longer protect you. Except for these guys. You are now authorized to have a combination for the supply cap. It would be 76, but now we have the combination to the safe. And we got a new weapon. Did it show it? I'm not even sure if it showed it. But it is the All Rise. 90% will reduce weight and plus 10 health, which is pretty cool. Let me in, damn it. Are you not gonna let me in? Oh, okay, there we go. I'm actually gonna put on that fedora. All right, hold on. Let's actually put it on. Uh, crumpled fedora and the patched suit. Because we are the mayor. Very nice. All right, where's the thing? Right there. Mayor's combination. Eight stim packs. Radaways. And I don't really need any of that. But, I mean, that's going to do it. We're already close to an hour. So we're definitely going to call it a video. 
right here right now if you enjoyed this video do me a huge favor drop a like on the video subscribe to the channel if you're not already subscribed and we'll definitely catch you on the next video deuces Thank you.